What's up to all my Dre gamers out there? You're locked on a channel that brings you Metroid, Sonic, and Pokemon LPs. I'm Chris the Dre Musician because gaming is an instrument and I'm playing Metroid Prime 2 for the Metroid Prime Trilogy on the Nintendo Wii. Now last time we got our two temple keys. We're in the Dark Torvus Temple. We defeated the Chica that is actually the Larva Chica. Now we're facing off against the Chica which is an actual adult. And let's go ahead and scan this thing right quick. If it would just not be weird. Alright, sweet. So, flying insectoid, insectoid guardian. This like creature can be stunned, especially by dark energy. While stunned, look for weak spots to target. So, we need to. I guess we need to use the dark beam on it to stun it. Oh, shoot. Anyway, all right, and then while it's doing its thing, we can actually Oh dear. Can I just aim at it from up close? But it tends to flee in the other direction. charge at me the heck is it doing sweet wait a minute I'm already as back no I'm not Wow. Oh wait, I have no missiles. Wow, I have no missiles to fire at it though. That's the thing that sucks. How do I get missiles? Alright, so this episode's gonna suck. I don't even know what to fire at in order to actually get missiles. Alright, this is going to get really annoying really quickly. Because without the missiles, we can't use the seeker missiles, and without the seeker missiles, we can't really attack it like we can, or like we should. Come on, give me something to... At least give me something to get missiles out of. I don't even know if I can get missiles off of that. Oh, there's that. I guess I don't need missiles. I guess... I don't know. I guess I just suck at this boss.
Right, let's go ahead and there's the third one. Okay, I think I remember what happens now. As soon as we get f rid of f four of his wings, I think it falls into the water, and then it turns into a dark chica or something like that, and then it becomes a completely different story. I think this one, it, like, um, drops items and stuff as well. Also, for some reason, I guess I feel it's easy for uh, me here than it is on the actual GameCube because we still, I just want to click your wing. Wait, I didn't even sneak around to the backside. That's what happened. Whoa. But yeah, notice that I'm not even losing any of, like, all of my health yet. If this was Metroid Prime 2 for the GameCube, I probably have already died at this point. Alright, there's that one. I was going to end up falling into the water. Whoa. Venture flotation systems are function in, in erratic action. Alright, so this is Dark Chica. Charged with dark energy, most of his body is immune to damage, save for the lower axe sack. Avoid attacks by targets offspring swarms. So I guess we attack that thing. Oh, this is where we get this is where we get the drop off items and stuff. All right, that's good. That's good. We're actually making progress. Maybe. Whoa. That was a really big attack. It looked like it didn't attack, but although it did. Alright, sweet. So now we're back to normal, kinda. I think we can finish this boss off right quick now that I know exactly what I'm doing or at least I remember exactly what I'm doing there's another wing doing that can I just stun it with missiles nope because they deflect or he deflects it whoa that was weird fire at this thing Yikes. Well, I missed. Oh, 
Okay. So this should be. Oh, nope. Stop it. And why is everything rumbling? Oh, I think he. I was say he knocked over the platform. Or knocked the platform off. Sweet. Now we can go ahead and. Come on, hit hit it. There. There we go. Alright, we're almost done. Let's go ahead and get rid of these things so we can get some more items, especially like some missiles or something, so we can use super missiles. Oh wow, what the heck? It keeps deflecting them. I guess we have to be close range with it. He deflected at that time. At least he's given us items to actually use. Alright, I'm gonna quit using the super missiles. Or actually I lied. <laughs> the super missile is what defeated it, so. So now we have some sort of like visor. Let's go ahead and pick up these items. Now we have what seems to be an x ray visor, or is it a dark visor? Dark visor. And it does. Raw, really? Pretty much views things that are invisible. Yeah, whatever is invisible, you can actually see. Huh. Whoa. I knew that wasn't going to go. <laughs> I jumped off kind of weirdly there. Alright, so we're finally done with Taurus Bog, I guess. Well, actually, first we need to... Grab the energy from here and then take it back to Taurus Bog, I guess. Oh. I'm tripping. Alright, so let's go ahead and get the energy from here. Any reason why you just jammed your cannon in there? I don't know. Like, I don't get it. Like, you're put you're putting the energy inside yourself, but you're jamming your cannon into it, so what sense does that make?
this place looks really weird now that we uh, got the energy. You know, we got all the dark energy out here now. This place looks weird. I think that just means that this place is kind of starting to. Kind of. Yeah. Anyway, so the in the next world that we'll be going to, we'll be end up, we'll end up getting our spider ball. Get it is very annoying, and then after that, we also need to get our power balls, which is actually in Torres Bog, but we can't get it without the spider ball. So, yeah. Anyway, we can refill our ammo too. So let's. Which room is it? Over here, sweet. Let's go ahead and refill our ammo. And we're actually going to go ahead and make it back over to Taurus Bog. Ammo supply replenish. Oh yeah, which by the way, I think we ended up getting our annihilator being next uh world too. So that'd be quite interesting. Let's go ahead and go up there and get the heck out of here. Oh, wait, what the heck am I doing? Alright, so yeah, this world looks plenty of messed up now. That dark pre was going to like blow me in a, or uh, push me in another direction that I don't want to be in. Alright, so we are just about here. Yeah, I don't know Tor Dark Taurus Box map as much as I do the actual Taurus Box map, but... Oh well. Now we just need to go... We need to head off to our right. Oh yeah, I know where to get, I know how to get that now. Well, of course I know how to get that, but. Uh. Stupid thing. This thing gets on my nerves there. Alright, so we have another missile expansion because we have the grapple beam now. So, let's go ahead and return that energy, and I think we sh we'll call it quits for there. No grapple point, but oh well, it doesn't matter. Oh yeah, by the way, what you guys might be confused as if why I keep switching over. I know that you can hit the blue doors with any beam, but I like to preserve my ammo, so that's why I keep switching the power beam to take care of the blue doors. I find it unnecessary to do so with the it with any other beam, so. I heard a bunch of 
thing. I guess I was hearing things. Alright, so we're just about ready to deliver the energy over. And we're here. Now here it makes now here it would make sense for Samus to jam her cannon into the thing because she's forcing a lot of energy out. Jamming her cannon in to suck energy in does not make a lot of sense at all. Unless that's just one complicated machine and that's the only way Samus could uh get energy from it. And now this place is a lot brighter. Alright, so when you take the world I mean when you take the energy from dark aether, it's a lot darker and more destructive looking. But whenever you put energy back in actual aether, then everything looks bright and peaceful. And I think that's Isha. I think. Oh, that doesn't really matter. This temple's energy has been restored. So let's go ahead. Actually, we're going to go ahead and end off the video here because we're actually out of time. I'm currently at 50 minutes, but that's because I have kind of did a two-parter, but anyway. Well, that's the video. If you liked the vi if you liked it, click the like button down below. If you're feeling a lot, a little bit more generous and wants to show me some more support, click the subscribe button down below. It's the big red button below the video. Uh, you'll be informed whenever I upload a video, as will also happen if you subscribe, or not subscribe, but uh, follow me on Twitter which the description to that is in the link or the link to that is in the description wow and you also be informed of things like streaming on twitch which also my twitch channel is also in the description down below but anyway, i'm going to get out of here because i've been recording for a straight hour so thank you guys for watching i'm chris the dread musician because gaming is my instrument what's your instrument